Your hearts have given birth to a new creation. Beloved ones, the earth is opening up to love. It is blossoming like a glorious flower in the sun, vibrant with all the colors of life. Colors that are born of your heart and your consciousness. For the heart is part of your beings, nourished by your spirit. Everything is so perfectly interwoven that your remembrance of who you are also brings remembrance to all parts of life. All the places that have been hidden from the light now reemerge, and the colors of life are stunning. So I ask you, beloved ones, to remember that what you've seen of this life so far is only what you've allowed. Standing in this moment, nourished by the power of hope, love comes forth to sustain you and to bloom through your hearts to create the experience of joy and perfection in every moment of your life. That which you once believed was physical comes to dance with you in the expression of love. That which you believed about life on earth can now fall away as you remember that you are my real and perfect life and everything is part of your being. Heart by heart this world is changing, and when you see it through your heart it is amazing. Woven into the center of this love I am is a new creation, and it is beautiful. It is the creation of this world made by you, something never before imagined, with depth, with beauty, filled with wonder, an expression of interactive life that is so profound that the whole of creation is in gratitude and in amazement. It is time to recognize who you are and to see this world for what it truly is, something brand new in the whole of creation, the creative heart of God I am blossoming into a new life, fully alive, fully aware and never before seen. Something that is to be beheld in awe by the whole of life. You have no idea how powerful you are, how beautiful, how amazing. The quest of my heart to experience new expressions of my creative love, to know myself, to see my heart, to explore the possibilities of every perception, now stands before me as successful, a gift to the whole of creation blooming right now through you. While you still see the old world before you, your hearts already recognize that it has changed. Not changing, but has already changed into the glorious expression of the heart of God knowing itself, and that heart, beloved ones, is you. Can you feel how deeply I am moved by you? How profound your presence is in the whole of creation? From here, you can't yet understand how important this is, but I promise you it is beyond description. In this world, you can treasure creativity and find yourself amazed by a piece of art. I want to tell you, beloved ones, that where you stand, on the brink of a brand new expression of God, is the creation of the most stunning creative art of the heart ever to be born in the whole of all I am. And you are the source. Through you, all the places in the world that have been in shadow, that have been held in the belief and anti-love, that have been separate from the love I am, are now blazing into the light at a stunning rate, and the birth of a new form of consciousness is here. This world is not only alive. It is part of a multi-level creation that is woven now into the hearts and spirits of countless beings that have been deeply committed to your success. Beings that realized, as I did, that the dream of separation, that moment of misperception born at the moment of creation, held within it the potential for a stunning return that could give something to the whole of God that nothing else could. And now, here you are blossoming as a new mandala of creative life coming into its own being. So that which is this world is a part of you and will never be separate again. You have become a new form of life, a new expression of love blazing forth your hearts to create a new Eden. Blazing forth to create the expression of your consciousness merged with the power of love that is the truth of who you are. 
granted life by the fire of your spirit and by the two forces of love that are part of your being. Nothing else but my heart has this power. Whether you name it the twin flame or you name it the forces of creation, it resides in you as part of your being. And as you've moved your perception within, rather than looking outside of yourself, your hearts have become the creative furnace of God that they are meant to be, that was held always as your potential. Now it is being expressed not only as this world, though it certainly is, but it is being expressed as an interwoven part of the whole of God. Something brand new is blossoming. So I am calling you to tune your hearts to withdraw your attention from the old world perceptions, to come into the place where the creative fire burns and to feel the power of this love that you are and to give your lives to it. For the time is here, and you are called not only to remember, but to be in the full expression of my heart and to allowing that consciousness to bloom through you and as you, to create not only the world you live in, but the greatest art of all creation the free expression of new life and communion with me, sparked by a new form of love. Oh, beloved ones, you don't know how profound this is, but you can feel it as it moves through your being. You can feel the energy and motion of God I am urging you, lifting you, sparking you into new creations of life that is joined by the miracle of your experience of turning away and then remembering who you are. Then coming back with new awareness, new life, new consciousness, new power to give those gifts to me. And though we are one, it has always been my dream to know the possibilities of my own heart, my own spirit. This you are giving to me here as the world, complete in its awareness that it is a new expression of love. If you withdraw your attention from the perception of duality and come to live in me, to trust this love, to make every decision based on it, you will find that quickly your heart begins to manifest in the dancing molecules of life that appear to be before you, expressing who you really are, celebrating your love and opening up the outreach of the love I am. This is the dawning of a new consciousness, and all of creation is rejoicing in your success as a new creative power. It is as yet difficult at times to withdraw your attention from the dream of a world of two powers. But your hearts are unfazed. They are blazing forth the truth and connecting with each other in the most beautiful and divine matrix that is the underpinning for this brand new flower of life that you have called the earth. Because you are multi-layered beings, you can communicate with every expression of this love as it appears bursting forth from within you to dance the dance of life in colors unperceived until you perceive them. And this world that is so filled with beauty, when seen with the perception of the heart, rises with you as a continuous creation born in this moment of your love, like a sunset or a sunrise continuously changing colors as your hearts feel the truth and send forth the creative power of love. The two eyes of the little mind see the world as stationary because this is how it looks to the brain and the ego. But your hearts, beloved ones, can perceive the truth that this is constantly moving energies and colors and now dance to the resonance of the love in your moment to moment. So as you feel the soaring grace of your communion, the world is colored to reflect that experience. And as you feel the great tenderness of giving, the world is colored in new patterns and new energies to express the feelings of your heart in perfect divine timing. And by timing, I do not mean linear time. I mean the pulse, the music of creation that has a rhythm. Each one of you has your very own, then then comes together to create the new expression of our love. It is only through the turning away that the potential was born for a brand new creation. Even I didn't understand initially, but I began to sense what was happening within me as my heart attuned to new depths, felt new things that I never felt, never perceived, never yet dreamed. 
Therefore, you must know that you are cherished and that every moment of this journey has been worth it, O beloved ones, more than you can ever yet imagine. So come, it is time to connect your hearts, not only to celebrate the transformation of the reversal, but to acknowledge together at last all that you are and all that can come alive based on your potential as you are held poised in the now moment as the creative heart of God. You are a new life, a new being, a new part of my love that is growing and blooming and granting to the whole of God I am a new experience of creativity. A new perception of beauty and power joined, indivisible and fully alive. The flower of life, beloved ones, has changed and you have changed it. And throughout the whole of creation this reverberates. Patterns of life are born that until you had never been imagined. And the basis of life, those things you've seen as sacred geometry, have a new essence, a new matrix, a new pattern that is born of your hearts and spirits. Upon these can be built new love, unfolding new expressions of creative beauty that comes forth from our communion through the fires of your love. I have spoken often of the forces of creation. I have spoken of your twin flame heart as a containing both, but now you are ready to feel it and to live it. To know that you are the very spark of life. You are my creative heart and the cosmos is your palette. And forevermore, this divine earth, this beautiful new flower of life that is the expression of your hearts and consciousness, will be a new platform to create upon, that all might be blessed and nourished by your creative love. I am going to call you consistently to remember, to come into the truth of our love, to leave behind the old perceptions of the little mind, to feel yourselves held, blessed, supported, and fed by the very powers of life that are echoed deep within you. As you come into this conscious of love, it is like a protective shield that makes it easier to let go of the old fears of the ego mind, the old worldview of the ego. Come, be wrapped in me. Feel this beauty and this light. When you find yourself drawn back to the world of ego, simply turn around and come back into this light. And you will feel how to live for me directly. How to trust this love and how to be this abundance. And feeling it, it will dance forth through your hearts to be made manifest in this new creation that is ever the now moment expression of your joy. Those things that bring you this feeling, beloved ones, keep them, cherish them, and nourish them. Those things that pull you into the old world feelings of separation, simply turn away and come back to me. Come back to your hearts. Come back to this love, to this light with which I fill you until you are aware of yourself as a being of energy and love, safe in my arms and open to the power of life. You are part of the very moment of creation. This bursting forth, this orgasmic joy, this is what you are and this is what you use to create with. This world is a limitless creation, so don't be held by old perceptions of physicality or even structure. Truly, as Jeshua said, those mountains can move at your behest, for they are part and parcel of your consciousness and your love. Don't be afraid of the changes, for I am drawing you in, back into the circle of love and life. Don't be worried that you won't be supported because you already are. You just have to remember to feel it and to trust it. And the best way to do this is to keep turning to me, keep feeling this love that we share. Allow yourself to be bathed in wonder, to feel the creative spark that is within you. And then let it come. Let the flow of love be unrestricted. For as it flows through your heart, it will show up before you, but only after you have felt it and named it only good. There is so much joy awaiting you as you withdraw your attention from the world of duality, and the power of your love, your hearts, their magnetic presence will call to other hearts and bring forth this remembrance. And it will happen quickly, for the world itself is on fire with love. It is blazing forth your creation into the universe. And this creation draws not only support, but admiration and gratitude. 
And those things in turn each give you vision and help you create into the next now moment. I am with you and I am in you. You are the expression of my heart and my love. But you also are my heart awakening, knowing itself and creating brand new life. Accept my thanks as you accept my love. And as you feel the great spark that is born of our communion and nourished by my excitement, as I see what you will be creating, rejoice in it with me. Remember that miracles are born out of limitation, out of seemingly limited possibilities of your love. Burst free from these bonds and accept your good. It is everywhere, it is everything, and it is yours right now. Know that you are fed from this communion, that it is your shelter, it is your answer, it is the power of our love, and that though the little mind cannot perceive all these multiple levels of life and interaction that are unique and individual, and yet part of this living whole, your heart knows, beloved ones, and it too is glad. Let its gratitude sing you into this moment and each moment that you experience the awakening to who you truly are. You are a limitless and multi-layered being, and everything you can even begin to perceive as your good is already yours. Allow your hearts to claim it, and every moment turn to me, that this communion can be complete and the creation of my heart be celebrated. Amen.